All right, guys, so um, obviously we're here now. We're just going to have a little video hoping to dispel some of the fears of the people that come to boot camp. Because obviously if they're sat there and they're thinking about booking or thinking about coming along, there will be things that they're worried about. Uh, and I'm, I'm just going to go through a few things. And all I want is your input, really, about how you help people get through the week and dispel some of them fears. So first of all, the fear of, the fear of pain. So obviously people might be thinking, I'm going to come along, get a, bit of, a few aches and pains and what have you. What would you say to people if they're worried about that? I mean, I'd say pain is obviously a, a good thing. So, you know, you are going to be feeling pain when you come here. Um, but as we always say, it's a, it's a good sort of pain. You know, it's a pain that lets us know and lets yourself know that you're obviously working and working your muscles. So probably, yeah, we are going to come here and we are going to obviously put you in a bit of pain with your muscles as DOMS comes on over the, um, in the obviously a couple of days after being here. Um, but we can also deal with that pain and, and, help, and help you push through it. What you've got to think as well is the, the outcome of a pain is going to be a lot more uh, beneficial and it's going to stay with you a lot more than the actual time that you get in the pain for, you know. There's a little saying, you know, uh, pride lasts forever, you know, pain is temporary and the fear of doing something is always worse than actually doing it, so just have a go, see what happens. And we look after you enough to obviously maintain, if it's a serious pain, obviously we'll address that, we know the difference between... Um, you know, a serious muscular injury and just a bit of aching, mm -hmm. just a bit of dom. So we can tell if you're sort of trying, if you've obviously got a serious injury that we need to attend to, or if it is you are just sore from the exercise that we're doing here. So you've got to remember, everyone's in the same boat. Everyone in the group, yeah, usually whether it's five, fifteen people, is feeling the same pain, same lactic acid. You know, so it's not something you're going through on your own. You're all experiencing it together and you're going through it together. Cool, great. Um, okay, so what about the fear of being shouted at? Fear and shout that obviously we do employ some uh, we do employ a military theme at Team Boot Camp here. Obviously it's, it's how we pride ourselves on both being ex military, but we don't sort of shout at you for no reason, you know, we shout to encourage you and we will shout in the circuit generally because you know we we're often talking to ten plus people so we need to shout to get our voices heard, but very rarely do we shout at an individual in their face directly, so that's not something we do here because we don't like singling people out for their mistakes, so we do always shout out a group just to get our point across and obviously encouragement is a good thing which, when shouting as well. Exactly guys, it's never aimed at you, it's just all encouragement and plus a bit of shouting just brings on the military ethos, you know, we're not shouting in a nasty sight in your face way, we're just trying to shout to get the best out of you and the voices are heard over anyone else, you know. Excellent, yeah. what about the fear of injury? Fear of injury is obviously a massive one, we try to, um, we try to prevent injury here as much as we can um, and since we've been open, we've not really had any sort of serious injuries that prevented anyone from doing any of the sessions. Um, and that's simply down to the structure and the ethos that we work here. I mean, we look after your bodies from the moment you arrive, from the moment you leave. So um, the way the days are structured and the way we, you get briefs about how to look after your body, how to stretch yourself, uh, we dedicate time every day to stretching. So injury, can't help injuries if it's going to happen, it's going to happen, but we like to manage it and not we can always say that we can always work the rest of your body, even if you do pick up some sort of injury. I mean, I myself would train people with no legs, you know, with broken ankles or broken legs, and they've still got a good workout, so we can always work around injuries. That's right. And out of all the boot camps we've done, the people we've trained, you know, would say we've had a very good track record at this camp for no injuries whatsoever. You know, it's all about periodizing your training, and this is where we excel at periodizing the training and structuring it so you don't get injured, you're not overloading your muscles, you're not working the same things all the time, you're doing different things all the time. You know, you can't help the odd little slip or fall, okay, but we're always there, we're always watching and there's people on site to help you as soon as that happens, so don't worry about it. Okay, and the final one, and perhaps the biggest, uh, there's lots of people out there that are absolute beginners to exercise, perhaps never done a, single, a squat properly in their life, and there'll be a real, a real fear of, of failure of coming here and not achieving what they're looking to achieve. What do you say about that? Well, I personally say, obviously, anyone who sort of books online has already taken a massive step in, obviously, they, what they know they're maybe quite unfit. They obviously know that they need to address it. So just from booking to come here, they've already achieved more than most people do in their lifetime, just from saying they want to come here. So, you know, we're used to training people who have never done a squat before in their life or never done anything before in their life. So that's why when they do come here, we dedicate the first day to sort of like an introduction to exercise and just ease people in and like I say there's always two trainers sort of look at people who may be a bit weaker who maybe need a bit more attention um, so if you're a beginner to exercise you know it's we can sort of teach you right from the base right from the ground up so that's not that's not a problem for us either. Most of the time guys you will be very surprised at how much you achieve 
and how well you perform in your time here. You'll, yeah, you'll get a bit of aches and a bit of doms for the first couple of days, but by the end of the week, if you've not done anything before, you'll be twice as strong and twice as fit than you was. You know, as I always say to anyone, it doesn't matter if you're the unfittest person in the world or the fittest. You know, the boot camps, they're, they're tough and rewarding for everybody because, you know, everyone's trying hard, everyone's getting pushed 100%. You know, just have a go. Cool. Thank you very much, lads.